Last watch, February 17. The difference between those who love the world and those who love Christ is so plain as to be unmistakable. While the world uh, is ambitious to secure earthly treasure, God's people are not confirmed to the things of the world, but show the earnest, watching, waiting position uh, that they are actually transformed. Uh, uh, the homes in this world is within the context of the world, but they are not of the world. Uh, they are looking for a better place or a better country, which is a heaven. The Bible says in Mark 13, 35 and 36, Watch ye therefore, for ye know not when the master of the house cometh, at evening, or at midnight, or at the crock crowing, or in the morning, least coming suddenly, he finds you sleeping. Let's consider the word suddenly. The word suddenly here in context means unexpectedly. Uh, understand that when Christ comes, he is going to come unexpected. Uh, you might be wondering if his coming will be sudden or unexpected for you. Now that depends whether or not you are prepared. If you are not prepared for his second coming, uh, then it will be a total surprise for you. But if you are preparing every day for him to come, although we do not know when he's coming, uh, the fact is that if we are prepared, when Christ comes, it would not be a surprise because we would have been looking for him all the time. It would not be unexpected. Uh, but today, I want us to trust in God's word. I want us to ask God uh, to grant us the ability to prepare uh, for his soon return. That is the power of his word. Why not let us ask him? Uh, Father, we just want you to grant us the ability to prepare for your soon return. Make us fit in, O oh Lord, uh, so that we would appreciate your coming. In Jesus' name, amen. Remember, my dear friends, the power of the word every day will keep the enemy at bay.